hope you're prepared to lose that contest, disaster. Because I'm going to write the coolest story ever. Please. My story's so cool, it's going to host the next Winter Olympics. My story's so cool, when my air conditioning breaks, I stand next to my story to cool down. Well, my story's so cool, because everything I type in my magic typewriter comes true. <gasps> Did you just say you have a magic typewriter? Uh, yeah, right. It's a magic typewriter. He bought it from a leprechaun with my money tree. Right. Well, I guess I'll mosey along. I'm going to the gym. That's right. I work out. And that's how I won first place in the short story writing contest. And next week... I'm going to win the cake baking contest. Not so fast, Red. <laughs> I'm going to win because I bake the sweetest cakes. Please, my cake's so sweet, you get a cavity just by looking at it. Yeah, my cake's so sweet, my grandma wants to squeeze its cheeks every time she sees it. My cake's so sweet, Instead of having a sweet 16 party, girls have a my cake 16 party. Well, my cake is so sweet. Instead of having sweet 16 parties, girls have my, my cake S sweet 16 parties. You already said that. <laughs> sweet, sweet victory. Or should I say my cake, my cake victory? Can you taste the heat? I taste a second place certificate. Oh. <laughs> Come here, little feller, and taste some real chili. My chili's so hot, you have to stick your tongue in fire to cool it out. Oh, yeah? Well, my chili's so hot, NASA uses it for rocket fuel. My chili's so hot, it's the second leading cause of global warming. Well, my chili's so hot, you have to put a smoke detector in your underwear before you eat it. My chili's so hot, they're thinking about renaming the sun, my chili. Yeah? Well, my chili's so hot, it... It... What's the matter? Can't think of anything else? Don't feel bad. I also won first place in the Smack Talk Showdown. <laughs> For two. I plan on winning the barbecue sauce cook-off, too. Not so fast, Red. Gotta go, Grandma. The barbecue sauce with the strongest flavor wins. And that's gonna be mine. My sauce is so strong, it can do 50 one-handed push-ups. Oh, yeah? Well, my sauce is so strong, it won an Olympic gold medal in weightlifting. My sauce is so strong, when superheroes are in trouble, they call my sauce for help. My sauce is so strong, it's doing a buddy cop movie with The Rock. My sauce is so strong, they're thinking about renaming Hercules, my sauce, you lease. Okay, that one doesn't even make sense. I'm here for cheerleading tryouts. Don't want to start with the manatee cheer or a handspring. Not so fast, Red. Shuck. You're trying out too? I'm not wearing a track suit and body glitter for nothing. You're not making the squad. There's not enough glitter in the world to make you a better cheerleader than me. First of all, I'm already a better cheerleader than you. And second of all, there's more than enough glitter in the world. I should know. My family's in the glitter business. Good. You don't have a job to fall back on when you don't make the squad. Easy, boys. I know you're both tough. Oh, I'm much tougher than he is. I'm so tough, Navy SEALs want to be me when they grow up. I'm so tough, when something bad happens, people don't say, tough luck. They say, chuck luck. I'm so tough, if I were a math problem, I'd be impossible to solve. Okay, guys, let's channel all that aggression into a cheer. For our contest. Size Daz who's brave enough to stick their bare feet in this tub of cockroaches? No one? Yes! I win the scooter! Woo! Not so fast, Red. What are you doing here, Chuck? 
I'm here to win that scooter. You mind holding these, little lady? Actually, I do mind. Okay. <laughs> the rules are simple. Whoever can stand in this tub of cockroaches the longest while reciting poetry wins. That's gonna be me, Chuck. I can stand in cockroaches so long, birds are gonna think I'm a tree and build nests in my hair. <laughs> oh, yeah? I can stand in cockroaches so long, I'm gonna grow a beard down to my ankles. People are gonna call me Rip Van Chuckle. <laughs> I hope they do Shakespeare sonnets. Well, I don't care about the money. I'm just here to bring joy to kids and wear a really cool fat suit. The most of the fat suit. Well, since you're the only guy left, I guess you could be Santa. Yes! Not so fast, Red. Chuck, what are you doing here? What does it look like? I'm here to bring good tidings and cheer to the children of Miami. <laughs> no one's as jolly as me. I'm so jolly, when I was born, the doctor slapped me and I laughed in his face. Well, I'm so jolly, people in England don't say, have a jolly good time. They say, have a chuck good time. <laughs> my float design. It's called the Ocean World, or habitat, if you will, of our mascot, the majestic Merino High Manatee, sometimes referred to as the Sea Cow. <laughs> wow, that's a long title. But I love the float! <laughs> yes! I'll start building it. Not so fast, Red. What are you doing here, Chuck? I've got some... Float designs of my own. Bunnies, really? Wrong page. <laughs> I just like drawing bunnies. Since homecoming revolves around football, my float's gonna have a quarterback that hurls footballs as far as the eye can see. Ooh, I like that. A football-themed float is perfect since homecoming revolves around football. Yeah, that's literally what I just said. But Kiwi, I thought we decided on doing the ocean world, or habitat, if you will, of our mascot, the majestic Merino High Manatee, sometimes referred to as a sea cow. I don't care what you two do, as long as we win best float. Well, let's get started on my manatee float. It's clearly the winner. <laughs> I don't think so. My float's such a winner. When people win the lottery, they'll say, Congratulations! You are the lucky Chuck's float. <laughs> oh, yeah? My float's such a winner. It'll win the Oscar for Best Picture, Best Supporting Actress, and... Oh, yeah. Best Float. <laughs> My float's such a winner. They'll have parades in its honor. My float... will have float. Nice touch, Chuck. But it's not as sharp as mine. Please, Red. My tux is so sharp, it comes with safety goggles. Oh, yeah? My tux is so sharp, I got a paper cut just putting it on. My tux is so sharp, Japanese chefs use it to chop vegetables table side. Do -do 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 My tux is so sharp, teachers warn little kids not to run with it. My tux is so sharp. Instead of pencil sharpeners, people use pencil my tuxiners. Okay, that one didn't make any sense. Eh, I'll admit that one was a stretch. Point is, I look sharp. Now you do. won't have down buttons, they'll have Chuck and Sunny heat buttons. Well, bam! You're going so 
so far down. Pillows won't have down feathers. They'll have disentrish feathers. <laughs> Big finish. Generous donation. Ure song lea chakahaja. So long, Red. He's about to meet. Wanna see the layout? Not so fast, Red. Did you clear that with the rest of the yearbook committee? I.E. Me? Chuck? You two are in the committee together? We put aside our differences in the interest of creating a great yearbook. Yeah, I decided to be the better man. Actually, I'm the better, better man. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, I'm so much better that instead of a best man at a wedding, they have a Chuck man. <laughs> oh, yeah? I'm so much better that instead of a dog winning best in show, they win Des in show. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, I'm so much better that instead of BFFs, they have CFFs. <laughs> Chuck friends forever. I'll settle this. You're both the worst. 